With the 2021 fall cold and flu season bearing down on us, the question remains, are supplements still an important part of virus protection and mitigation? Immune supplement purchases alone skyrocketed about 70% in 2020, and the overall supplement market increased by 10%. Before COVID, immune health seemed to be a seasonal topic, one that was primarily discussed around flu season. But James Laval, clinical pharmacist, board certified clinical nutritionist, author of more than 20 books and clinical director for the Pro Football Hall of Fame Performance Health Program says that immune supplements are not just for the occasional cold, rather they should be part of a daily protection plan to maintain good health year round. Hi James, welcome to the show. Always good to be on your show. I love having you. And we've done other videos. So if you haven't heard Dr. Laval's videos, I highly, or interviews, I highly recommend checking them out and we will put links below. Okay, so Dr. Laval, last year, people were buying tons of immune supplements. Do you think that we still need immune supplements if we have vaccines? Well, I mean, I, I think that everybody learned a lot about having to take care of themselves during the last year and a half. You know, whether it was understanding the value of better sleep, maybe not having that virtual happy hour every night. Uh, those things were important, getting exercise, but I think supplements still end up being important because in the end, people still end up, even if they get vaccinated, they're still prone for colds, flus. And then even in addition to that, you wanna keep your immune system in balance. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. What are the supplements that you think people are buying when it comes to immune health? Well, you know, the obvious ones were, you know, C, D, zinc, quercetin, everybody was running out for those. It made sense. They're valuable and essential nutrients. But I think there's nutrients that you need to consider for just keeping your immune system in good working order. Aged garlic extract, for example, otherwise known as kyolic, Magicare, plant sterols and sterilins, really excellent nutrients that you can take throughout the year. So James, what is an immune modulator and how is it different from like an immune booster? And is there one that's better than the other and why? Yes, great question. I mean, first of all, it's important to understand that your immune system's working 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. It just doesn't start working in September and stop working in March. Your immune system is actually responsible for regulating your defense to anything from a twisted ankle to a virus. So you, you need to think about how do I keep my immune system in balance? An immune modulator would help both aspects of your immune system, known as your innate immune system, how I'm going to go and attack a virus or a bug, and your acquired immune system, which is, am I getting allergic to something or having an inflammatory response to something? So an immunomodulator actually feeds both sides of the immune system, kind of like a teeter-totter that you want to keep in balance. When you think of an immune booster, you know, there's great immune boosters out there. Andrographis, for example, probably a great antiviral herb to take if you got the first sign of a flu bug or cold or the, the classic echinacea. But those aren't things that you nece necessarily take all the time because they start to shift the teeter-totter a little bit. Immune modulators like Magicare, which is a plant sterol and sterilin, which is a plant fat with a plant flat glucoside on it, okay. it keeps your body fed so that that immune system stays in, in, you know, in balance. And so when they gave this to example for marathon runners, marathon runners get sick after they'd run a marathon. They get up, they're prone for upper respiratory tract infections. Because when you train a lot, you push your immune system. And when you push your immune system, you're not able to get those killer cells and natural killer cells out there fighting as well. So when you take Magicare, you keep the ability of those, those uh, natural killer cells and T killer cells to be able to fight the good fight. Hence, they didn't get sick after they ran their marathons. And whether you looked at the arthritis studies or the allergy studies, or you looked, or fibromyalgia studies, or you looked at um, Magicare. Magicare actually helped to reduce the symptoms in all of those situations. And the reason for that is, is in all those situations like allergies, that teeter totters out of balance. Your acquired immune system's overworking, and you're not getting that balance back, and so you start to get extra symptoms. So Magicare is invaluable because of that. 
It reminds me when I was in university, I have my, my mm. best friend, every time we went through exams, after exams, she literally would get sick. It was like clockwork. And I guess it was because she was studying really hard or kind of similar to what you're, what you're talking about. So it makes sense to me. So in the case of, you know, she, I should have known about Modicare Modi back then, which I didn't, but that would have been a great product for her to take to prevent her from literally breaking that cycle of always coming down with some type of cold after she was studying. So you, you mentioned, you know, briefly, you kind of explained what Modicare is made of. Can you go just a little bit in more simple terms? Like you mentioned a plant fat, and then you mentioned something else, which I, I didn't exactly catch. Sure. So, so sterols in sterolins are the ingredients in Modicare. Okay. And it's in a very specific ratio. So actually the studies that Dr. Buick did in South Africa showed a hundred to one ratio of sterols to sterolins gave the best immune response for individuals. So it's not just the fact you can't go get Benicol butter, which is a sterol ester, which works for lowering cholesterol. You can't take that and help your immune system out. These are specific plant fats that are extracted in a very specific way, okay. along with what's called the sterolins, which are a plant fat with what's called a glucoside or a sugar moiety attached to it in a specific ratio that then when you take them helps what would have helped your friend get through that stressful time when they were studying. Right? right. And look, we're coming into that season where it would really be helpful for people because, you know, obviously the pandemic on the top of everyone's mind, but look, there's a lot of people, colds and flus have not gone away. Yeah. And the fact that, you know, holiday seasons are stressful. Uh, people are still learning how to work remotely and, you know, versus going into their job or they're going back into their jobs. There's just a lot of reasons for people that helping support their immune systems makes sense. And it could be for a variety of reasons. I mean, people get herpes outbreaks, you know, people are more prone to colds and flu. Um, people that have, you know, chronic kind of candida, which is, you know, something, gosh, I've been working on that for 35 years with people, you know, right. people that have autoimmune disorders, people with chronic fatigue. Um, I think one of the biggest ones, more people started to exercise during the last two years. And, you know, when you exercise and some people were, I got so much time on my hands, I'm doing more exercise, right? I'm doing two hours a day instead of an hour. Right. The more you train, the more your immune system needs help so that you can recover for the next day of your workout. And a lot of people don't realize your immune system is responsible for how well you're going to exercise that following day. Oh, okay. That's so interesting. So, so Modric are really, or I guess these plant sterols is, are there for everybody, right? So whether we're stressed, like you brought up so many different parts of our lives and I'm like, yep, check, check, check. <laughs> you know, we've got the stress, we've got like the daily life, you know, we've got the exercise, whatever everything is. So really this product's for everybody, right? Yeah. I think anybody can benefit from taking Modric I, I mean, you know, it's, it's plant-based, okay. uh, absolutely non-toxic. There's no side effects. There's no known drug interactions. Uh, so that makes it, you know, really desirable, uh, you know, suitable for vegetarians. Uh, you can get it in a chewable tablet. I got to tell you a little story. I know for my son, I started him on Magicare when he was really little and I would open up a capsule and would give him just a little bit and right. put it in his food. Uh, and then I, he went to the chewable tablets and, you know, he never needed an antibiotic until the age of 19. Wow, that's amazing. Uh, for, for a kid today, when, you know, going to school and getting exposed to stuff, we were always able to utilize natural therapies that to, to help him get over his, his, you know, whatever it is he got exposed to. And I'm convinced that Magicare was a really important part of that for him. So these are the plant sterols. Are there other ingredients, like other, are there foods that contain these plant sterols, other ways that we can get it as well? Well, I mean, when you eat plant food, you're going to get sterols. The issue is, is that you're going to have to eat several pounds of them. <laughs> so, so, you, you get, so you get them. Well, look, I mean, we, we've saw the studies recently that have published that showed that people that ate more plants were less prone for uh, COVID, for example, right? So the higher the intake of vegetables and fruit, the better the person's immune response was. And so I think part of that is probably due to the fact that you're getting a multitude of nutrients, including sterols and sterolins, uh, by eating more plant food. And, and, and that doesn't mean, oh, you can only eat plant food. But I think most people today, 
still, if there's one area that I find when I'm counseling my patients, uh, cause you know, I, you know, see patients quite a bit still, uh, is it's getting them to eat more vegetables, mm -hmm. you know? And, and so if you're not going to be one of those folks that loves eating more vegetables, I think Modicare almost becomes essential because right. you're not getting that nutrient really any other way. Which makes sense. And the vegetables are so important. Our vegetables are so important for obviously the fiber and we've got the, the vitamins, the minerals, the antioxidants. Now you've got our plant sterols. So like to me, like it's so they're crucial. So I'm happy that you said that. How does, you know, the plant sterols and Modicare compare to like taking our vitamin D and our vitamin C and our zinc or other things that help to boost our immune system as well? Great question. So it's a little bit different because, you know, vitamin D is an essential nutrient. Your body starts to not function correctly when you don't have adequate vitamin D. Same thing with zinc. You need zinc in order to mature your T killer cells. So zinc and vitamin D and C are essential nutrients. I look at Magicare in that category of almost like a superfood, right? It's a nutrient that's derived from food that really feeds our body and helps it to be able to perform in a superior way. Um, but you can't deny that, you know, people should be making sure they're getting their vitamin D and their zinc and their magnesium. I'm a big fan of magnesium. I always got to put the plug in for that. Uh, and yeah, and vitamin C and quercetin, all really good for people to consider, but it's a different category. Just like if you go and reach for echinacea, it's a little different category. Not something you're going to, that's something you're not going to take every day. I think Modicare is something that people could take daily and they're going to see benefits from it because they're just going to, you know, they're going to recover from, from stressful events. They're going to recover from, you know, working out hard and they're going to recover from, you know, the fact that during cold and flu season, you get exposed to more stuff. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. So if people want to learn more about plant sterols and sterilins and like the research behind it and Modicare, where can they find out the information or where can they go? Well, uh, they can go, actually, uh, Magicare is made by Wakanaga, the makers of Kyolic aged garlic extract, which, you know, dedicated to science, an incredible company that really puts the science first. Their website, along with their educational resources, they can go, they can get a deep dive on Magicare and all the information provided at it. They can go to kyolic.com, K-Y-O-L-I-C dot com and you know obviously magicare available at you know i think virtually every uh natural food store that i've ever been in uh but you know and and also uh you know just look for it online if you have to but great easy to get to at the local health food store and we've been working with Wakanaga at Naturally Savvy for so many years. So I'm a big fan of the company. I'm a big fan of Kyolic. And, you know, it's funny, years ago, I remember hearing about Modicare. And um, I remember taking it. And then once we started working with Wakanaga again, I started incorporating it back into my daily routine. And we and it's great because they come in. Talk about the formats, because the one that I have would be like these chewable um, tablets, which I mean, they taste really yummy. But talk about <laughs> the different ways that you could get it. I mean, it's great. It's great for kids. It's great for, you know, after dinner i like to have it just because it gives me something a little bit sweet i really like it but what are the different formats that's available in yeah it's either in a capsule or in a, in a chewable tablet you can do it either way you're going to get the same benefit one way or the other uh you know i use it in practice every day i mean i i think i recommend it i mean i, I i'm not going to say i recommend it on every patient because i have to work on specific problems with individuals when i get them the maintenance they definitely are on it, but I'd say, you know, half of my clients are, are taking Magicare because I, I know now, and I, like five years ago, if you talk to people about the immune system, everybody be kind of, uh, I don't know how to talk about it. Now, everybody's interested, right? And they want to learn about it. And, and I think, you know, Magicare is at the right place at the right time with the research behind it. Uh, I, I think it's going to be a big winner for people because they're finally going to, you know, they finally are engaged in understanding your immune system and want to work with their immune system. Right. And I think the research is key because every, you know, m many of us now we want to know, okay, we're going to take a product. If it's a supplement, it does it ha actually have clinical research behind it. And you're saying Magicare does. Absolutely. Okay. Amazing. Well, thank you so much for being on the show, Dr. Laval. It's great. Enjoy it as always. <laughs>